What's up, beauty gang? You guys should already know what's going on when you have to rock a style like this. I just had wash day and no time to do my hair, so I grabbed a headscarf and out the door I went. But I've been seeing a few reviews on this golden hot straightening brush, and you know your girl had to snag her one to see what all the hype was about. So inside the box came the brush, which was very neatly wrapped, and I ordered it off of Amazon Prime, so shipping and delivery was smooth as usual. So here's the brush, and they were even kind enough to throw in a manual, but your girl has been blow drying her hair since forever, so I will not be needing that. But back to the brush. It's very lightweight, which all natural girls love. The power cord was pretty long, so A plus for better movement. And it has three settings, cool, high, and low, which I found were pretty easy to navigate to and from. So as you can see, I am super ready to put this thing to the test. So my hair is washed, detangled, and deep conditioned. I just have it twisted into smaller sections and I'm going to separate these twists into four sections. For the first section, I'm making sure my hair is still detangled and my hair is completely dry so I'm going to go in with a heat protectant spray and some oils before straightening. The heat protectant that I'm trying out is the Carol's Daughter Spray and the look that you see on my face is a look of regret. This spray was somewhat hardening my hair and it was just so sticky and gross that I almost decided not to use it but I persevered. Although I did not like this heat protectant spray, I knew that I was going in with different oils. So I went in with some Jehovah oil and that made my hair a lot more manageable, followed by my favorite straightening serum, the Chi Silk Infusion Oil. Now let's see if this brush really works. I decided to use the cool setting on this side of my head to see if it made much of a difference when straightening and y'all. I was impressed with this brush, although I felt my hair could have been a little bit more straightened, <laughs> this brush knocked my straightening session down by over an hour. So just a quick comparison of what my hair looks like before straightening versus after. And as you can see, I am in desperate need of a trim, but we'll get there. <laughs> now on this side of my hair, I decided to go straight in with the high heat setting. And off rip, I could already see a difference in length versus when I used the cool setting. I also didn't have to go over my hair too many times to achieve the straight look. So here's my hair comparison of using the cool setting versus the high heat setting and I can say the only difference that I really saw was in shrinkage but both sides of my hair had volume and I could run my fingers through each side. I did however eventually go back over the cool side with heat and here is my hair all blown out beating my record time. Now it's time for me to cater to these ends. And voila, just like that, this is my new favorite tool. I found this brush to be so helpful and it literally cut my average straightening time in half. If you guys have any questions, be sure to drop them down below in the comment section. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon.